disclaimer. Be advised that I'm not a professional trader or advisor. I am sharing my trading journey for entertainment purpose only. Any opinions, news, research, analysis, price or other information contained in this video is my own opinion and does not constitute investment advice. I will not accept liability for any loss or damage including without limitation to any loss of profit, money, asset or any valuables which may arise directly or indirectly from use of information in this video. Trading foreign exchange indexes, stock market, futures, commodities, energy, precious metal, etc. carry a high level of risk and please trade on your own research and assessment. Please seek advice from a professional financial advisor for your trading needs. Hello my friends, welcome to Trading KS. So today is uh, 11 of March. So already take profit uh, market after a few days uh, uh, search. Uh. So today actually KLX, KLCI actually dropped. Uh, okay. No doubt it's still in a bullish okay the the, the, the recovery right the rebound still look bullish okay but after a few days uh search there's a uh, deemed to be a uh consolidation deemed to be a uh correction right so today I think I think this one is rather a correction rather than a drop okay so uh drop back to one six two nine so still above one six one three right we talk about the one six one three is the uh, resistance now broken become support. So as long as you say above one six one three, okay, still looks bullish. Okay, so drop uh, zero point six three five uh, KLCI, Singapore up zero point eight five four, Hong Kong up one point six five four percent, South Korea up one point eight seven nine percent, Japan up zero point six zero three percent, Thailand up zero point one three two percent, Philippines drop uh, one point three zero nine percent. FTSE China up 2.86%, SSE China up 2.356, so bullish, uh, very bullish, uh, okay, Asian stock, Asian stock very bullish, uh, the big brother is uh, up, okay, uh, quite a lot, Australia, okay, down 0.03%, very little, so uh, Indonesia up 1.049, uh, there's a big, there's some big news on the China later, I think I, could, I will cover the news on the China, Okay, bullish news. New Zealand also up 0 0.168. Taiwan also up 1.684. Okay, let's look at uh, India also up. Nifty 50 also up 0 0.506. Look at Europe down. Okay, FTSE. UK down 0 0.228. Germany DAX up 0 0.017 little bit. US Dow Jones up 1.485. S&P up 0. 603 uh, so US starting to be bullish uh, okay after the the uh, approval of the stimulus okay the stimulus they are processing the check out uh, soon they will be uh, releasing the money okay so this one we can see where the people okay the US people after getting the stimulus where they want to put their money okay stock market likely Bitcoin likely okay go possibly Okay, palm oil, crude palm oil up 0 0.185. Okay, palm oil also, the palm oil stock also got some movement. Uh, okay, maybe want to take a quick look because uh, there's news talking about the Malaysia want to increase the uh, palm oil palm oil product export uh, for this year. Okay, so there's a small, some push on the palm oil stock. Okay, maybe today I think I don't have, don't have enough uh, time to talk about palm oil. Maybe uh, tomorrow or the day after tomorrow. Uh, uh, maybe a Sunday, okay, Sunday video. Tomorrow will be Friday, a lot of profit taking. Today already start profit taking, so tomorrow could be another session of profit taking. So maybe Sunday we talk about the the, the different a few sector, the few sector that okay will be affected by this one, the growth of the US, okay, the growth of China, the growth of the uh, palm oil, the projected growth of the palm oil. Okay, brand oil up, uh, okay, up 1.060 and a crude oil up 1.16102 uh, but nothing much happening to the our local stock except Dayang. Uh. Okay, Dayang, just to let you know, okay, today I'm not covering the oil stock. The oil stock not much movement, only Dayang got a small breakup. Go up 0 0.714, uh, so they are holding the, holding the channel bottom. Uh. Okay, silver up 1.052. Okay, 
So let's look at KLCI and look, look at our local counters. So today very good. Gain, gainers is still top the losers. Uh, okay, even though it's a KLCI drop, but gainers still top the losers. Okay, 640 to 410. Uh. COVID slightly, slightly up uh, the cases today. 1642. Okay, but still not that much off. Okay, so the, the, the downtrend, this trend line still intact. Okay, it's almost intact. Okay, so uh, hopefully there's no more big spike up. Okay, to alter the trend line, this one, this this downtrend trend line. Okay, hopefully there's no more uh, spike. So uh, okay, look at the news. This one, uh, Istone, uh, okay, Istone they are committing 30 percent uh, dividend. Uh, okay, thirty percent dividend uh, on this year. I think I got an English one. Okay, there. Okay, M Flex uh, used to be I Stone. Uh, so, commit to dividend policy of the, at least 30% of profit. Uh, okay, so this one. Okay, we can take a quick look what happened to I Stone on the. On the KLEC, KLSC screener. Okay, very easy. Okay, you look at the news at the bottom. Okay, okay you look at the I stone. Okay, if you look at the news at the bottom, there's an I stone. You click the I stone or M flex. Now they call it M flex. Click M flex. Okay. Add to watch list. I already add to watch list. You can click the technical chart straight away. You can okay go into the technical chart. Okay, it's very convenient. Okay, KL, KL uh, SE screener is very convenient to use. Okay, a rebound at 50, a rebound at 50, a stone. Not a great deal of a... Trend line to draw, maybe there's a trend line here. So we haven't break, uh, okay? So this one have to watch out. Okay, watch for it to break this trend line, okay? Watch it, watch it to break, okay? To break this trend line up. I'll draw a trend line in this triangle, okay, here to here, okay, if we can break up, then possibility, okay, possibility that it's a con continue, the price can continue to go up, okay, the next target, of course, is the high, previous high here, okay, 0 0.32, okay, the net resistance, okay, the next near-term target, if it can break up here, okay, and it can break up here, possible, there is an opportunity to look at a 0 0.32, Three, two, one. Okay, ice stone looks uh, look bullish. Okay, their chart is bullish. Okay, but quite uh, volatile. Okay, their stock is quite volatile. So they have to break here first. If they come up here, okay, have to break this high first. 0 0.38 here will be here. We have another resistance here. Okay. Zero point two eight around zero point two eight. Okay, you need to break zero point two eight and break this. Okay, this are uh, center trend line, break above zero point two eight possible. Okay, we can look for this one. Okay, 0 0.32 or the top of the channel. Okay, just click save. Okay, so this one like how we see inside the okay, how we use the KLS KLSC screener. Okay, remember to log in first, uh, okay. Must log in first. Okay.
So you remember Sun, Sunrise uh, bought the this one uh, the old Dutch Lady factory area uh, at TJ there near the near the roundabout there, the Sin Sin Chu roundabout there, right? So if I remember correctly correctly, so uh, eleven thousand acre uh, okay UEM Sunrise uh, so big project coming okay. Uh, mixed commercial project uh, so UA, UAM Sunrise we take a look at UAM uh, very aggressive uh, UAM Sunrise okay a lot of announcement a lot of uh, a, a, a good uh, white coming Okay, bullish, bullish uh, uh, trend, okay, it's still bullish, healthy uptrend, okay, uptrend is still healthy intact. Okay, for long term, right, okay, if you haven't buy here, okay, for long term, I would, for me, I would look for a break up here. Okay. 50 cent, 50 cent to 5, uh, 52 cent, okay? So this is resistant over here, there's a, there's a triangle over here, okay? So it need to break up, for me, right, it still need to break up from this triangle to see momentum, okay, long-term momentum. So the price already oversold, you see, it tried to it already come out, right? The price already overbought, okay? So most likely, it will drop back a little, okay? It will do, okay, maybe it, it, will, it will break this one or come back, retest, readjust, right? Because price cannot always in the overbought, right? Can, cannot always in overbought. So it maybe it will uh, do some correction and come back down and rebound. Okay, so most likely you come here after it break this one, it will come here, readjust and rebound. Okay, so after rebound, so after it break here, possible. Okay. Target fifty eight cent six sixty seven ten seven fifty five. Okay, so we look at the triangle. Uh, so this is the range of the triangle. Uh, okay, the range of the triangle. So after if it able to break up for the triangle, right, it should be traveling the same distance. Okay, so the ultimate one, the ultimate target will be eight ring eight eighty cent. Okay, so. Hopefully, okay, it can uh, break out over here. Okay, once it break out over here, looking all this, looking at these positive vibes, okay, positive vibes, uh, positive news, okay, if it can continue to go after break, continue to go, the ultimate long, long term one, we will be looking at uh, 81, okay, this is shorter term target. But first, okay, wait for breakout, okay, wait for breakout of this line. And this line. Okay, let me record down when we talk about UEM. You can have more problems. Okay, Malaysia Bank earning to improve in 2020, uh, but uncertainty remain. Uh. Okay, so this one is a uh, good news for the bank. Okay, good news for the bank. Okay, so uh, so here KLCI break four day gaining streak uh, on profit taking uh. Okay, so this one, uh, people already start to take profit uh. So tomorrow maybe they have another round of take profit. Okay, so for the short term, uh, stock right, you are investing short term. Okay, maybe look at tomorrow. Okay, there will be uh, some other take profit. Okay, so for long time, for long term, I think we can hold. Because the price already, 
the KLCI already broke 1613, right? So it's heading toward bullish unless it breaks back below 1613 for long term holder. Okay. Here, okay. Malacca Securities Research Head. Okay. Lau, 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 Lau. Okay. If I'm not mistaken, uh, okay, so investor decide to take profit, uh, okay. So mine tech get essential contract, uh, mine tech, uh, go mine project, uh, okay. So let's quickly take a quick look at mine tech. Okay, we can do it here. Okay, with the KLAC screener, this how easy you can use KLAC screener, okay. Just look at Mindtag. Mindtag is a loss making company. Yeah. Okay, quite similar, right? The function with, uh, with this one and the chart that I'm using. Okay, so at the bottom, draw a line connecting all these. Okay, so mine tag. Uh, I haven't drawn any line yet. Let me draw some line to see. The okay, mine tag is just recovering from lower low. Uh, okay, so this is still. Uh, it broke up, okay. It broke up already from the, okay, from the this one, okay, from this uh flat pet from this uh channel pattern, okay. It really broke up, slowly go up, okay. But, okay, to buy right, okay, to buy, we would prefer, okay. The price, okay, a drop back to this trend line, okay, rebound, okay, to buy. Or, okay, the price continue to go up, break this trend line, okay, break this area, okay, retest, then buy, okay. So, uh, uh, this one, okay, if the broke, the breakout actually here possible to buy, right, but the price really came down, okay, already uh, readjust, okay, some adjustment. So, the problem is it cannot break above the 200 MA, uh, so this is a 200 moving average. So, as long as it cannot break above the 200 uh, moving average, it's still risky to buy, okay? So possibly for me, right, I want to wait for it to break the 200 MA, okay, break above 240, okay, or uh, uh, 0 0.24 to buy, okay, or, okay, the price came, come back down, test this trend line, rebound up, rebound up, okay, then opportunity to buy, okay? So this one also I really add to watch list. So add to watch list, okay. Remember, okay, just click this one, click watch list, save. Okay. So next time you just come to your watch list here, right? All these stock you already save will be there with all the line, okay? And flicks really top. So China, you see China, right? The boom, right? China February smartphone shipment built on post uh, post pandemic rebound. Huh? So there is a big rebound uh, shipment of smartphone with China. Within China, uh, jump three hundred thirty six percent, uh, okay, to 20, 21.3 million, okay. So it was up three six point three million, higher than the fourteen point nine million, okay, on February. So. Here, despite the pandemic, handset brand now face a production issue due to global computer chip shortage. Uh, okay, due to also the U.S. extension, a uh, U.S. Uh, China tension. Okay, so good news uh, for our semiconductor company. Uh, should be good news for our semi semiconductor company in Malaysia. So now Warren, so Warren Buffett already reached a hundred billion. Uh, Yes. It was a spur. 
blowing me and blowing you. Okay, so Warren Buffett now reach uh, 100 billion. Uh. So, uh, so, so he's the number fifth richest, uh, the, 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 the fifth or uh, five only a uh, billion, hundred billion people, uh, so in the world, right? So congratulations to him. Okay, it's long term investing all work out. So government from Jana. So this one government approved the uh, recovery plan. Uh. Micro FFI have benefit from the scheme. So, uh, okay, potential, uh, anyone uh, doing business, maybe can take a look at this one. Okay, Punjana, SME Financing, maybe can help out you guys with your business. So, the uh, DNEX, uh, what all about the DNEX, all the goring is about this one. Uh. So, they back a three year contract extension. Uh. For NSW, okay, National Single Window. Uh, so take a quick look at uh, D next. Okay, news a bit out. Uh, so so today a big drop, but still not a big drop. Okay, still holding quite well. Okay, but this one already uh news already out. Uh, so be careful. Uh, okay, so people might be able to maybe people should. Should could be able to start, maybe maybe able to start selling. Uh, okay, uh, the holders okay may start selling. Uh, this is, should be a lot of uh, the fund managers. Okay, the the the, the last uh, organization. Uh, the organization, the fund managers, the the bankers. Okay, so should be could possibly you know, start to throw. So be careful. Bintai signed the cold chain box with uh, Saudi, okay? The distribution in Saudi, uh, okay? So take a quick look at Bintai stock. So we, we look at this one, okay? Watch list. Save in watch list. So we take a quick look at Bintai with our KLSC screener. So close but no cigar, right? Close but no cigar. Okay. So today got a push, but at the end of the day, being pushed back down. Okay. So this is just a short burst. So this one is not opportunity to buy in. Okay. Opportunity to buy in you must close above this. Okay. Uh, this trend line, then there is only opportunity to buy. Okay. So you cannot close above this opportunity, this trend line. So this is a okay, just a. Uh, short pump, okay. Short pump. So this one, looking at this, okay. If we cannot break up, okay. Of course, it, it, it could continue to come down, okay. So all these uh, uh, speculation, okay. Already going last time, okay. So now all these are the news coming up, just per all the previous speculation. So analysts. Still maintain buy call on Hatta Lega, but cut the target price already. Yeah. So they keep on calling buy call, uh, okay, and never give any, <laughs> never talk about buying uh, Hatta Lega, right? 
so now they are they, no, so now they are cutting down uh, okay they are cutting their expectation uh, so I never actually bullish on Hatha Leica so uh, let's take a hard look it's a good company okay Hatha is a good company previously you okay, can make a lot of money because of club right club is all good company but now okay the Hatha is still on a strong downtrend uh, okay even the bullish top glove uh, record making profit also doesn't leave anything or uh, doesn't push anything uh, so this is after keep on going down so this consolidation after consolidation might continue to go down okay or it might continue to go up a little bit okay after consolidation maybe go up a little bit and come down okay unless it breaks up okay this trend line and breaks up once 1175 okay 1175 then then maybe we talk okay Mind tech, do we talk about mind tech right? Okay, mind tech, do we talk? Okay, some Some uh, news, uh, some announcement side part, okay, side part, uh, their director, uh, their director start to dispose uh, stock uh, 1 million, uh, so be careful. Hong Leong Bank, okay, Hong Leong Bank EPF start to dispose their stock half a million. And uh, Sam Dabi, okay, Sam Dabi also EPF start to dispose their stock, uh, so be careful, Sam Dabi. Sam Dabi has some, recently have some spike, uh, okay have broke out from the triangle. I'm not sure why they want to. Okay. Here, Sandabi. Sandabi. Okay, actually it broke out. Uh. See, Sandabi is going up, you know. I don't know why they are, they, they throw the stock. Maybe they report it down here. Okay, already make profit. Okay, so today is a profit taking day, right? So maybe they already take profit. Okay, they report it here at the low. Okay, 2.1. Two, two, two so now they are because this one RSI almost reached the overbought, right? So maybe they really throw it, but this one is bullish, uh, okay? For me, right? Sandabi is bullish, uh, okay? Sandabi for me, right? Okay, I'm, I'll be looking at 2.5. If can break 2.5, I'll be looking at 2.68. Okay, 2.8. So ultimately, right, I will look for three ringgit. Okay, three ringgit for uh, uh, some Dabi. Okay, and as long as they don't, they don't drop out from this trend line. Okay, draw a trend line here. As long as they don't drop out this trend line, right? I'm looking for okay, three. Okay, long term I'm looking for three. Okay, Sandabi, I'm quite bullish on Sandabi. Okay, from the chart study. Okay, so I'm not sure why they sell. Okay, maybe they really bought it long time. Okay, uh, another disposal today, uh, Sandabi, right? So uh, Amala Saham Bumi Putra also disposed, okay, 965,002.4 million. And the public bank also, uh, EPF disposed 2 million stock. And Kajar Prospect, uh, Kajar Prospect, their, their directors is buying their stock, uh, okay, buying, uh, buy, buy, buying back their stock. So uh, all their director, Latin Tong, Atuti, Mr. T, okay, so they are buying 130,000 or 3, okay, so look like they, look like they could be bullish. So Tiongnam, Tiongnam also, their director actually bought some of their stock, uh, 80,000 stock. Dasco, so Dasco, they split the share 1 to 4, uh, okay, 1 to 4, okay, so that's why the, you see the sudden drop of the Dasco stock. Sunway, so Sunway EPF bought uh, 225,000 okay, of their stock. K 
KGB, okay, KGB also uh, they are director, uh, they bought some of their stock, uh, 50,000 and 20,000. So Do Pharma, EPF continue to buy uh, Do Pharma stock, okay, another 1 million. Uh. Maybank, okay, EPF bought some Maybank stock, 165,000. And my EG, okay, my EG, the, the director, uh, okay, acquired their stock, uh, 245,000, okay, my EG had a drop, okay, has had a drop these few days, okay, maybe they, they think it's cheap. Okay. So my EG okay already drop uh, okay drop outside this fan line uh, okay so so okay maybe the maybe the trend line could be here okay so want to see okay my EG want to buy want to buy my EG right wait for it to go back up this trend line first okay go back up this above this trend line possible okay go back up above uh two two ringgit okay then uh it will look long term bullish okay for now i'm not okay uh, not certain but this could be but this still a, a area to support area here okay there's a support area here okay i marked here last time okay there's still a support area possible okay the price can come up okay go above this uh this trend line okay and i'm go above two two ringgit then possible long term bullish okay so uh uh by eg also like i said before, oh, it's a stock that I hold long term. Okay, but EPF, uh, if you also bought uh, 4 million, uh, okay, 4 million on the stock, dispose some but bought a lot, okay. So my EG, maybe something on my EG here, I'm not sure yet, but uh, not still not look bullish, uh, not look bullish yet, okay. I think there's a channel over here, yeah, okay, so there's a channel over here. My EG, okay, so you need to break out here, you need to break out here, okay, break out this channel and also break out above this trend line okay break up these two possible is a uh, opportunity okay opportunity okay so wait for a break wait for a break up Okay, today, uh, today the big gainers uh, is the non-energy mineral, mineral uh, okay, non-energy mineral, which is uh, the metal and uh, steel. SCIB. Okay, SCIB has a breakout today, uh, okay, breakout, volume looks good, volume, okay, looks good, a break above, okay, a break above the uh, 50, okay, from below 50, up to above 50 uh, RSI, a break of this trend line, okay, SCIB, okay, very good push, looks very good. Short term target 2.5, longer term target 3.4, sorry, 3.4 and 3.7. Okay. So looking at the 
looking at the movement of the chart, right? Okay, I think the top target will be around here, 3.4. Okay, from the current two ringgit, two ringgit. Okay, the top target would be around here. Okay, around here. Okay, if we continue to go up, uh, okay, if we continue to go up, we will be looking at uh, okay, three ringgit to three point four. Okay, so this is a uh, SIB bullish. Okay, not bad. Okay, SCIB not bad. Possible this one. I also okay look forward. Possible tomorrow also. I see what happened tomorrow. Okay, I'm so interested on this one. Okay. And uh, okay, others are the matter. Okay, the steel not not a lot. Okay, the steel doesn't really move a lot. The one that move a lot is Lion Industry. Take a quick look at Lion Industry. Okay, also Lion Industry also got a breakout uh, today. Okay, so got a breakout, so possible. Okay, uh, okay, also breaker volume, U turn from a fifty percent. Okay, RSI fifty percent. So this one is bullish. Okay, the next target will be <coughs> zero point nine four one zero six five and a uh, one zero one point one eight five. Okay, so. My target would be 1.065 to 1.185. Okay. So uh SIB line industry Franken. Okay, I'll talk about a few stocks that got action today. Uh, got some action. Okay. Possibility uh, some uh, possibility to break. So Franken have a uh, support at the middle of the channel here. So haven't break. Okay, so tomorrow have to wait whether the price can break up or not. Okay. So the price, if the price can break up for 4.8, so possibility we can buy and hold for around the 5.4 area, okay? So we have to see tomorrow. Lion Industry KSL. Okay, so KSL already broke up from the long term triangle, uh, this triangle, uh, okay. Okay, so today already broke up uh, and also broke up from 0 0.64, uh, okay, so this one, there's a possibility the price can go all the way to 7.8, okay, KSL, okay, not bad, already break up, okay, so this one is long term, long term, right, you draw a trend line here, at the bottom here, okay, connect all these three points here. Okay, as long as the price don't break out, okay, from here, possible can hold up to 7.8. This is a, okay, not bad, KSL also look quite good. MRCB. Also break out, uh, so broke out, okay, broke out. Come back, wait for a rebound, okay? Now the price is broke out, so the other side is really overbought, so wait for it to come down and rebound, okay? Possible it will come down to 0 0.48 area and rebound, okay? If it rebound, okay? So we will be looking at the top is uh, 7.20, okay? So our target will be near term will be 5.9, 6.5, and ultimate, okay? Longer term will be 7.2, okay? So draw a trend line over here. Okay, so the price doesn't drop out from this trend line. Okay, it doesn't drop out from this trend line, this trend line. Okay, possible can hold up to 7.2. All this is a possible, uh, okay. I'm not a I'm not a uh, advisor, okay, I'm not a stock market advisor, broker, okay, I'm not a consultant, uh, this is only I is what I feel what I would do, uh, okay, when I'm when I'm investing on all this stock, right? So data sonic, uh, I talked about data sonic yesterday, uh, just uh, short recap. Okay, so data sonic drop uh, okay today. Because as I said, you see this box, right? Okay, have a resistance in this box, so it needs to show that it can break above this box, then only possible can continue to go up. So you see it haven't okay 
reach the top of the box already, it got sold down. So this one be careful, okay? Wait for it to break out of the box. Okay, so that, that's it for today. I think this one a really very long video. Okay, thank you for watching. Remember like and share my video. Okay, don't forget to like and share. And uh, if you are new here, okay, thank you for watching. And also, remember to uh, subscribe. Uh, okay, subscribe and hit the bell. And thank you everyone for your comment. Okay, and for your uh, encouragement. Okay, I really appreciate you guys. You know, joining this channel. Okay, so see you tomorrow. Bye bye.